Hello, welcome to Rick's Tip of the Week. Um, this is kind of short and sweet, but it's something that you might find interesting. Last night, National Geographic played a documentary called Facing Arnold Schwarzenegger. Three months ago in June, they asked me to come in and do an interview, which was about a three-hour interview, which when you see the final product, it narrows down to about 10 minutes, but they do this to everybody. So I put it on last night and I watched it. It was on uh, from 6 to 7, again from 8 to 9, and again from 9 to 10. And it's really well done. It's really well done. Um, they had Barbara Outland, uh, who was Arnold's first girlfriend in Santa Monica, worked at Zookie's Deli. She had a lot to say about him back then. They had Lou Ferrigno in his opinion, Carl Weathers, um, different people that came across him in his life when he first came here. Uh, I was on, this is one of my segments I'm going to show you in a second, but I was on about four times and again at the end. But everybody had something to say about his career and how he moved along and how he did what he did and how his determination and his drive and his, um, his confidence in himself put him where he was. I think it's really a good documentary. I just did one just three weeks later for Germany that hasn't been out yet, very similar, called uh, uh, Heroes of the Week, I think Movie Star Heroes of the Week, Superstars, and so they asked me again to interview for that. But here's a small clip of what I did. There's a lot more on the show because it's an hour long. This is just happened to be the first clip I did. There's three more, I believe. So I'll give you an idea what it's about. opened it for his friends on the beach. It wasn't a well-known gym, it's just the fact that it's Venice Beach, Muscle Beach. The front door was open and the back door was open, and the breeze would just come through. It's very small, you could smell the ocean. It was the beach crowd. And when I walked in, first person I ran into face to face is Arnold Schwarzenegger. This guy's huge, weighed like 260. Big chest, big arms. He says, what are you working today? I said, I'm probably gonna do some benches, some chest, this and that. And he says, let's work together. He was strong, but I was always stronger in the bench press. My best was 455, this was like 440. So I gave him an inspiration, but we got along really well. We would see if we could keep up with each other. Of course, there was a little competition. And he flexed his bicep, Rick, Rick, check this out, check this bicep. And I look at him, like, God, it's huge. He had magnificent arms, his chest was like big slabs of meat. Big back, small waist, flat stomach. He had it all. He says, the German and the Jew training together. And I said, yeah, it's a little different, isn't it? Arnold had a very strong personality. He uh, was very focused. He can learn anything. And he's logical and he figures things out real quick. Once you come to the United States and you walk into Venice and the Gold and you see who's around, you see Joe Weider with the biggest magazine in the world that can put you over the top worldwide. And I think he saw that and said, if I get this magazine, I get the covers of these magazines and I win these shows, there's no limit to what I can do. Now, if you've seen this now, you can see that um the questions are good, the answers are good, they have everybody's opinion, like I said, there's things about Frigno I didn't even know and I know him well. And Barbara, of course, she's a, 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 an, an education now, I think a teacher or a principal. And they had Ivan Reitman, they had certain producers, and they had Peter Kent, who was Arnold's uh, stunt double in The Terminator, who looks just like him, only taller. I just think it's a good show. Now, if you missed it, I think if you go to the National Geographic, uh, National Geographic website, you might be able to find this documentary called Facing Arnold Schwarzenegger on their website. I don't know if it's going to be on TV again because next week's a new episode of somebody else, but you might be able to find it. So I think if you watch this and you listen to him, his uh, background and what he did to become what he became, it will inspire you to work hard at what you do, and um, I think you'll really enjoy it. So it's called Facing Arnold Schwarzenegger. It's on National Geographic. Look on their website, see if you can find a, uh, a posting of the show itself. It might even be on YouTube. I'm not sure if it's coming too soon for that. But take a look, and I think you'll enjoy it. And thank you for watching Rick's Corner. I'll bring you more news as it comes along.
That's rickdrayson.com. He is the equalizer, baby.